or God. Be somebody. Yeah. And be something more than what you see in the mirror. Yeah. Let the world be your mirror. Don't let them judge you. Because the mirror can't judge you. You judge what you see in the mirror. What's up, YouTube? It's Tyler Knight, and you're tuning into Ty's Life. I'm about to be reacting to, to another Jimmy Howell video, the Jordan video. This is the Jordan Marathon, because I've been reacting to, what? I reacted to five Jordan videos in a row, so, because um, my Jordan videos are doing pretty good. Um, people in the comments are always asking for more Jordan videos, so that's what I'm doing right now. Um, yeah, reacting to more Jordan videos. Uh, yeah, so this video is called The Only Player Michael Jordan Couldn't Beat. Um, I'm guessing this is what this was his brother because I heard about this story before a while back. Um, I think Jordan had a couple interviews talked to, talking about it where he didn't beat his brother in one on one and he couldn't at the time. Like when like the times they would play one on one, like his brother would just cook him. Like his brother's five nine, but he can dunk. Like his brother was nice. He didn't play in the NBA, but um, he played pro though. So yeah, he was he was good. So you're about to get into this video. Um, it's three minutes thirty nine seconds, so it's a short video. So you're about to get into this. Um, like, comment, subscribe, share. Uh, I'm trying to get to a thousand subscribers as soon as possible. So hit that subscribe button. Um, hit the notification bell beside the subscribe button. Yeah, you're about to get lit. You're about to about to go up this 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 year. Trying to get to a thousand subscribers. So yeah, hit that subscribe button. So uh, yeah. About to get into this video. Like, comment, subscribe. Michael Jordan is widely accepted as the best player to ever touch a basketball. But even he. Someone who also had the last name Jordan. Michael Jordan is widely accepted as the best player to ever touch a basketball. But even he admitted there was someone better than him. Someone who also had the last name Jordan. What's up everybody, it's Jimmy, and believe it or not, Michael Jordan wasn't always the best basketball player around. Ever heard of a guy named Larry Jordan? Yeah, I didn't either, until Michael Jordan himself admitted that it was none other than his older brother that was exceptionally better than he was. In an interview in 2009, Michael Jordan opened up about his brother's dominance. Back in high school, when Jordan was cut from the high school varsity's team as a sophomore, it was Larry who was the star of the varsity team as a junior. Their own father, James, even said it was Larry that had the real basketball talent in the family. MJ wasn't even the best basketball player in his house. Michael says they would play one-on-one -on -one and Larry would crush him every single time. MJ would do his best to emulate his brother from the way he shot to the way he dunked. Everything Michael did was an effort to be half the player his brother was. Only a year older than Michael, Larry was simply a much superior player. Michael even got his number 23 from his older brother, saying he wished he could be half the player his brother was, who wore the number 45. And of course, 22 and a half wasn't available, so Michael settled with 23. Then something changed. From the sophomore to his junior year, MJ had a growth spurt. And not just any ordinary growth spurt. Nah. Jordan grew from 5'9 to 6'4 in just one year. A 7 inch growth spurt. And with Larry still standing at 5'8, for the first time Michael was able to have the upper hand on his older brother. It was the next season when Michael was a junior and Larry was a senior that they played on the same team for the first time. And Laney High School quickly became Michael's team. Larry said, we played one year of varsity basketball together and that's when his play just went to another level. Even though there were five guys on the floor, he pretty much played all five positions. MJ went from JV player to an All-American in just two seasons, averaging an absurd 29 points, 12 rebounds, and 10 assists. The once untouchable Larry yeah, Jordan. That was crazy when I heard he he averaged a triple double in high school. Jeez, jeez, he was so dominant in high school. It's crazy. 29, 10, and 15. That's what it said. I was surprised when I saw that stat. Oh, 29, 12, and 10. Yeah, that's tough. That's tough. 
The once untouchable Larry Jordan had been dethroned by his own little brother. Still, throughout his career and to this day, MJ will tell you Larry was the better player. Just by watching Larry play, you can tell Jordan copied his older brother's movements. Even his competitive drive originates from his battles with his older brother. If I lost, I had to keep playing until I won. That's why more often than not, it would end in a fight. Michael said, when you say Air Jordan, I'm number two, he's number one. Which means in theory, Kobe copied Larry too. At 5'8", Larry was still able to dunk like Michael, but unfortunately for Larry, he was never able to get that extra few inches like Michael did. If he was even six feet tall, who knows what could have been. A lot of people that saw Larry play say Michael is just a six foot six Larry Jordan. In other words, if Larry happened to grow like Michael did, we could have had two Michael Jordans. And as competitive as Jordan was, it's unbelievable that he would admit anyone, let alone his own brother, was better than him. If MJ admits it, you know it's true. As a basketball fan, I almost feel robbed that I wasn't able to see two Jordan brothers play in the NBA. Yeah, but at least we yeah, got Michael. If his brother grew to 6'6", six, six, that would be crazy. That would be crazy. That would be insane. That would be crazy. Having two Jordans playing at that level. We'd probably be in a debate saying who's better, Larry Jordan or Michael Jordan. And then you would have to compare Larry Jordan, Michael Jordan to, to Kobe. I mean, Kobe, you have to compare Kobe and LeBron to Larry Jordan, Michael Jordan. It would be those four players that, like, who's the greatest of all time? Like, it would be that conversation. That sucks, though. I wish you could have seen that. I wish you could have, like, grew to 6'6". Six, six. That would have been sick. Like, that would be good for basketball for sure. Crazy. Little brother to the original Air Jordan. And as always, until next time. Yeah. Yeah, I would have loved to see that. Seen that. Um two brothers at that level, like crazy. I think I have to go back and try to find some Larry Jordan highlights because I, I hear things about him, but I haven't actually watched his game. Like, I haven't watched how he plays. Probably, they're basically saying he's a 5'9 Michael Jordan. Michael Jordan's a 6'6 Larry Jordan. So, <laughs> I have an idea how he plays, but I want I like to, I would like to see it with my own eyes and see how he, he played in high school or if they have clips from when he's playing professionally. I don't know. But, yeah. This is a good video. Um, this video was pretty good, yeah. It was lit. You know? Um, but like, comment, subscribe, share, and I'm out. I know my actions speak louder than me. They gon' always try to hate on what you trying to be. Then when you make it, try to tell you that they always believed. All they do is deceive. Then when you fall, all of a sudden they leave. <laughs> it's really comical, I always been a stand up. Plans of making bread, I'm not a fan of. Waiting on someone to save me with my hand up.